On this week's boiler tip, we're gonna take a look at some valve types, mainly comparing gate valves and globe valves, because we'll see both in a boiler room, but they have different purposes and they have different benefits and drawbacks. The main benefit of a gate valve is that it's designed to isolate. It's fairly simple in design, which basically means that it's cheaper. Um, and what it has is essentially a gate that descends into the valve and blocks the flow. So when this valve is open, there's really no restriction in the pipe. So they're less expensive and they add zero back pressure to the line. So they're typically used for isolation. Now, on a bypass line, like around this feed water valve, we have a globe valve. And if we look at a globe valve, we can tell just by the shape that it's a little bit different. And if we open it up, we'll see more about that difference. So the globe valve has a rounded seat, and the benefit of that um, is that we can throttle flow with it. So a gate valve, we want these gate valves out of the way so our modulating valve can do the job. But if we're operating the level manually or filling it, we want very fine control of the flow so a globe valve is better suited for the job. The downside to a globe valve is that they don't give unrestricted flow even when they're open. So typically a globe valve is not going to be used in a gate valve's place. They each have their role. 